Hi everybody, welcome back today guys to the channel Hot Wheels Unleashed. We're here back again for yet another episode underneath our early access uh, with that ultimate package that we have purchased. Now, today I wanted to go into the basement and the track editor and see what we have for customization, right? And things that you like and dislike about the game. And let's get a little comments going here for today. And uh, we have 715 tokens, uh, which I do believe we have a new set of cars rolling around. It does roll over every four hours. And look at this, Surf and Turf is available. RD02, which uh, I thought we had. Yeah, we do have that. We have the Mustang for 500. We can pick up the Mustang if we wanted. Skull Crusher and the 69 Dodge Charger Daytona for 1200. Oh, they're all so good. All right, I don't know yet what I want. I think I'm going to save up here for a second. Let me know what you guys have been saving up for in the comment section. Huge thanks for watching. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. Going into the basement, man. This, right? It's kind of weird. Ooh, this is cool. Living room, kitchen. Cup space, hobby space. Oh my goodness. So we get to customize our area and then make our tracks within our area? Is that is that right? Oh my goodness. Wow. Cup space, hobby space. This is incredible. Let's go into living room and we're starting off with the walls. We have floor, stairs, door, wall furniture, set of paintings, couch, coffee table, bar table, armchair, bar stool, pool table, shelf one, two wall mounted furniture one and two coat rack decoration one two three four five six seven eight nine like oh my goodness this is just for the living room okay let's go to the floors uh glossy now we have been unlocking some of these through the campaign mode so this is actually a reason to grind that campaign and get the proper house that you've been dreaming of right this is oh my god this is so cool they have really outdone themselves here on this game i feel like really cost 200 some of them are locked, some of them you have to pay for, and you can change the color of these as well too, which is nice. Ooh, for free. Yellow floor, that's kind of weird now. Go with a red floor, right? Why not, man? We're in Hot Wheels here for today. Let's go ahead and save that color. We do have an advanced palette as well too, if you'd like. Stairs, we do stairs. Oh, this is sick. Marble, steel, simple, solid wood. Let's go simple and We'll make this yellow. I think we're gonna make a Hot Wheels inspired room. I think this is gonna be really cool. Oh, red and yellow everywhere we can. Is this for, okay, so stairs, we have doors now next. Like this is, this is the Sims 2021 out here. This is, this is pretty cool. Different door option. Oh, we got it, wow. First game to do it right. I see, our glossy door. Okay, where we can't actually change what's on the wall looks like. Posters, we can change our posters. That's cool. We definitely gotta go. Or no, we'll go with the retro Hot Wheels. That just changes it up. That's actually super cool. They have thought of everything and then some as well, too. Really, really liking what they're putting down here on this game. Go with the yellow and the red pillows. Perfect. Uh, coffee table. Obviously, we gotta go yellow coffee table now. Uh, bar table. Oh, almost, almost bought that one by accident. Uh, armchair. Red velvet, like I said, I've seen this on sale somewhere, man. It was actually on sale at Canadian Tire, I do believe. You can't change the second color, though, which is the only other thing that sucks, but that's okay. At least we can change the color of everything in the room, though. I do actually like that a lot. Uh, Wall-mounted furniture, we got wood, we'll make this yellow. There's different things that we can put on the shelves, that's cool. Joystick there, Statue of Liberty, we got some interesting things there. World Globe, Health Potion, Shield Potion, Mana Potion. A little bit of succulents out here too. Oh man, this is awesome. Puzzle box we got. We actually unlocked these here. Looks like, okay, we'll, we'll pop in the puzzle box. Wow, there's a lot, man. I, I, right, I, I thought Grand Theft Auto had a lot of customization for walls, but this is insane. You can go with the brick. I think I'm gonna go with the brick here. What is this one? Look at the world map. Okay, let's go brick. We'll change color of the brick. Should I go red? Yeah, we'll go red brick as well. Have a look around here. Oh man, this is so cool. You can actually look around. I love this game. Try to maybe do a little bit different in the kitchen. We need to buy some new decorations, man. 200 bucks. I don't want to buy them yet though, because I'm hoping that I can unlock these instead. I'm gonna skip the decoration. Okay, so we did the kitchen onto the wall here on the loft. Definitely got to make this red. Oh, wow. That pops floors Ooh, arcade cabinets you can change different ones got the bone shaker on there no way even like the music in the background too just pump it man 
This game, the vibes are there. And they are good vibes, man. This is this has been a very addicting game as well, too. It makes me just want to keep playing. Um, I think it's one of the biggest things. And now the fact that we can unlock more things for our basement, I think that is that is one of the coolest things I've seen in a long time a game do properly as well, too. And look at this, man. Here's our basement now. Cup space. And now we're going over to hobby space. And look at this spot over here. Damn. So of course, we gotta finish it off properly. We gotta go continue with that red and that yellow theme here. Go yellow on the ceiling. I think that's a nice little brings everything together. Assuming we we may get more posters and such as we go. I don't know if we're gonna unlock more. I doubt it because there's nothing there. It seems like, but there's a lot of doors. I want one of these. Got to get them by unlocking in the city rumble. So we got to make sure we play through it. We unlock these, but damn, man, these are cool. Look at the gaming rig. We got triple screens. That's so cool, man. Now hopefully we can change our chair as well. Yeah, we can. Look at this chair. I can't change a color. I guess it's red. It doesn't matter, right? It's perfect. Computers. We can change all of our monitor colors. Oh my goodness. Let's rock the red on it. Was not expecting that at all. Um, we can change our shelf color. Go yellow on that. Decorations, again, we don't have them, so we're gonna skip them. And we're done. We have a fully customized basement. That's so cool, man. Hopefully we can get a new pool table soon. I don't know if that's a thing. Can we get new pool tables? Let's go on over here to the track builder and let's see if there's an option to browse tracks. Uh, Skyscraper, track room. Where's our basement? Oh, there it is, okay. Welcome to track builder, an incredible track laboratory that can be used both offline and online but first there's a couple things you need to know let's get started with the basics so i'd seen ign talk about this and they were saying uh you know it takes a good solid afternoon to really get down how this works and we're definitely going to make a track soon i don't know today is going to be the day because honestly i think it's just it's a lot to take in with the track creator now it looks like i may be able to place this right here can i do that oh there we go we got a hold left bumper in order to move it up. That's actually kind of interesting. I do like that, but we can start it right on the shelf if we want it, which is kind of cool. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at that. And you can also extend it out if you, wow. Left bumper, we can move it down. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's place that. Can I place it? Customize, oh, we could change the color. You can go left wall. You can actually add in the walls if you want. You can take them off. Oh, wow. Flags on there. And they're just so simple. They just click right on. Yeah, thank you. So how do I now go to the next one, right? This is, this is a lot, man. We're going to go ahead and confirm that. Yep. And then our next piece, we can change pieces, right? Yeah, so we go down to, we just move over to change a piece. Well, oh, these are all locked, looks like. We can't even, can't even really make a cool track yet. Yeah. This is wild, though. Okay, let's go ahead and close that. Wow, we can put on different things here. We can throw on a spider. Oh, that's a snake. Unfortunately, we don't have that unlocked yet, but that's that's pretty cool. We got a dragon. That's so what I'm gonna try. We can choose a finish line. You know, man, too. That's so cool. Basically, set it up on any of these objects as well, too. You can bounce it off them. Uh, like this is this is really a lot, man. Validation option. Test the track. We can't test it. Okay, it keeps going into the damn pool table. I cannot figure this out. It's gonna take a little bit of time, man. The track editor is a lot. Now I don't see anywhere that we can actually share our tracks though and it's saved okay i don't think we can share tracks right now there's got to be a way that we can share tracks might be a little bit disappointing if we can hopefully we can here uh let's go customize favorite vehicle we're we'll probably go roger dodger i think for this one though it does it does look the best here background uh finally change up this stuff here we got these flames a lot it's actually perfect for it Heck yeah. Card background. We got some different ones now too, finally. A little bit of customization today, man. Let me know your thoughts down below here on Hot Wheels Unleashed. And can we share tracks? Because it's kind of sounded like we can't. What I think I'm going to do here, we're going to go into one race here before we finish this off. And you know what? We're going to open up a crate. I said I wasn't going to do this, but we're going to open up a crate. Oh shit. Blind box. 500 credits this would probably be the time to do so considering the fact that you know we don't have a lot of cars it's very rare that we're going to get a repeat of a car but we're blind boxing it three two one here we go oh these are a lot of points now oh we don't actually open it we just bought it okay make a purchase in the shop well that's great open blind boxes blind boxes open we've opened one here's number two here we go Please be something good. Please be something good. And fast. And fast. Right? That's the key. Fast. Oh, we got the Night Shifter. 2021 Track Builder 5-Pack Legendary. 
That's a good car. Oh my god. I actually got that with my Hot Wheel package last year. Oh my goodness. That's crazy that we just got that. Uh, that's the only downside of this, but that, oh my goodness, that was a huge pull. I gambled on that and right, that, right, that was perfect. We can okay. dismantle. Did you see that? Dismantle? We can upgrade? What? I didn't know that. Wow, we can also sell the car. So we could sell the car. We put 500 in. We could get a thousand back and re-roll twice if I really wanted to. We can dismantle the El Camino if we wanted to for 50, 300 coins. That's a new thing I did not know. But that, wow. We're gonna do one online game here with this new car. Is it my basement? Oh, it's not my basement, okay. That was gonna get crazy if it was here. We are at the start of the pack. Screwed up my launch here. Hopefully we're gonna be okay. We got the best car out. What is that in front of me? Can we get this drift going? Double boost. It's got the speed, but shit, man. We don't have a lot of, what is, oh my, see ya. Oh, he's still in the air. I just looked back, he was still there. That is actually insane. Let's go. Oh, he screwed up too. We're in second. You can kind of get the drifts properly if you were going to set down and really just keep it going. Oh my goodness, look at that. Not like that. I ran this guy right. <gasps> I'm stuck. Oh my good. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, he got flying right there. Oh my jeez. I was so close right there too. Go. Wow, we have probably the fastest car in the game now, thankfully. A one of. My God, get off this thing. Here we go. Big moves in out here, big moves. Go, go, we hit that. Yeah, we got all four of us racing at the side here. Oh, oh no. Last few corners here. Oh, come on. I can't believe I couldn't get him. Wow. They have really dialed in this online experience, man. It's quick, it's fast paced. It's simple, you're in, you're out, you're getting your money. There's no lag, seems like. Everything is just fast paced and fun, man. Really been enjoying this. We got 65 coins for placing second. Damn. That was probably one of the best moves I've ever done right there. Rolling that box and getting that car. Uh, let me know if you guys have rolled the box and what you guys have picked out of it, but we are moving up the ladders here and we're gonna be definitely back if you guys missed my first episode on the campaign make sure you guys go ahead click that in the description box down below huge thanks for coming around for another hot wheels unleashed episode i'll see you guys back here tomorrow i'm out peace